<laughs> what an exciting day guys so i finished installing the unreal engine 5.0 and uh, i've also finished installing this uh, city sample project from the uh, in unreal engine 5 experience uh, on the matrix for based on the matrix 4 uh, movie and so i wanted to show you um, the scene i mean the scenes and what they look like so the way after you've downloaded this you simply have to create a project right here and once you've created it then it's going to show up in your projects so i had it in multiple projects but i noticed that the one that's on my ssd drive seems to run faster so let's go ahead and double click on this one and see what it looks like inside so that is the city sample you can see the outlook over there this is really exciting because I'm, i watched the movie but the one thing that i really really wanted to do was to go on the ground level and experience uh, the scenes and so I'm gonna be. I'm testing on a, this machine that was made available to me by the Puget System team. It has a 3090 card, and so I want to see how it performs. So off the bat here, yeah, they warn you that uh, this city, I mean this project itself, requires a 12 core GP, uh, CPU machine, 3.4 gigahertz. These are the minimum specs. 64 gigabytes of RAM. I have 256. A GeForce RTX 2080 or AMD, I have a 3090. At least five, eight gigabytes of VRAM and I have 24. So let's see how well the 3090 card performs on this much, uh, this uh, level. So let's go start with the smaller one, the small city, which is this one. Small city uses all of the systems as the big city. So that one I'll try out later. <laughs> but I just want to see what it looks like. So we go to the content uh, tab over here. Let's go to uh, environment, it's a uh, content map. Let's go to ways map. Okay, down here. And then we're gonna try the small city first. And I'm curious to see if all the physics work, the collisions, if I'm able to break up the cars when I'm driving them. And uh, let's see the environment itself, what it looks like, because we could we saw it on the consoles. Uh, they did a demo for PS5, and I also did a demo on the Xbox Series X. So here we go. <laughs> Already, you can see how beautiful it looks. Isn't that amazing? So let me just, uh, I want to be able to actually walk through this. But when I, let me press the G key to get rid of some of those gaming interface but i mean look at that guys this is inside of the unreal engine 5 this is incredible so i saw it inside of uh, the xbox but i really really pleasantly surprised to see how well it looks look at the textures if i go on the ground level right there that is amazing yeah and so let me go ahead and play this level and see how long it takes to play all right, press play. Let's be nice. It says 2.43 now. I'm going to see how long it loads. So this is the smaller uh, optimized version of the CD. And so let me see how long it takes. Still loading. <laughs> it hasn't been a minute yet. And you can see that the map over here, you can find it, click on it and go to different parts of this mega city. And... Uh, the cars are there the vehicles are there i actually wanted to change the post process volume so that the exposure is not automatic because i wanted to set it so i could actually see but we'll see how it does all right still waiting so depending on the machine that you have uh, this might take a long time or it might take uh, just a little bit long so now it's been so it's getting to almost a minute all right so it took about a minute to load okay and i really wanted to see I wanted to see, let me first uh, stop this. I want to see the frames per second. Let me show frames per second. So before I play, it's showing at uh, fifth, between 50 and 59, around there. So let me go ahead and press play. And this is without DLSS, see that, DLSS. So that's not installed yet. So let's just go ahead and play and uh waiting for it to load i know this is a massive city so all right so there's the meta human just like you saw on the console i can use the keyboard here to move her around i use my mouse key to direct her and man it's gonna be so much fun to go to the every part of the city and check out this uh environment 
Uh, right now it's about over 40 frames per second on this uh, the 3090 card and it looks great. Let me actually press F11 so we can go in full screen and I'm gonna drive one of these cars. <laughs> Let's go here. All right. Press D to drive. No, C. C to drive. Okay, get in. Oh, so she got in on the. Ah ha ha! I saw that. I saw what you did, Meta Human. So she got it on the right hand side, and she slid over to this other side. I saw that. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Last time I crashed like crazy. Let's see what happens now. Oh, <laughs> the guy is totaled. All right. Oh no. All right. Rewind or reverse rather. I'm thinking rewind. All right. Let's get over here. Oops. All right. Let's go inside. Come on. I'm a better driver than this, surely. Reverse. Look at the damage in there. And this is happening right here in the... Oh, the cars are coming. Oh, no. So this is happening as I'm playing right here on my PC. It's, this is not on a console. That's amazing. Crashing. <laughs> I rolled over several times. Isn't that amazing, guys? So when you get a chance, guys, just give this a try because it looks really, really cool. And just like it was on the console, I think it's actually looking better on the PC because I have a much better machine than my Xbox doesn't compare to the machine that I have right now. The characters look great. Uh, let me exit the vehicle, see, get a different vehicle. All right, so she got out on the right side this time. <laughs> All right, let's step away. So this is amazing, guys. So when you get a chance, download it. I think it's, it's a big file for sure. Uh, so you have to set aside enough space for you to experience this whole thing. But what a day to be alive, guys, to be able to actually have this kind, this level of detail inside of the Unreal Engine to get these uh, kind of frame rates. And when I look around, I mean, everything looks really nicely and aliased and smooth. The reflections work. Vehicles are working. It stopped. Uh, can he? I don't think I can get in that car. Get out. <laughs> There's a meta human in there. It looks beautiful. It looks amazing. And there are several files that they've made available in this build. So when you want to test out the vehicles by themselves, you can load that map. If you just want to test out the characters, you can load the characters if you want. So, man. <laughs> I know